Hello everybody, Tim Teacher here today. Today we're going to go back and do an idiom. The idiom today is through thick and thin. This one's a little bit uh, difficult to understand, uh, especially with our modern conceptions of, for example, weight, a person's weight. You might misinterpret what thick and thin means. You might assume that thin, because of uh, many modern ideas of beauty, is the good thing and thick the bad, right? Uh, that's just something that people do. That's, of course, not true, right? Nor is it accurate. Uh, but the meaning actually is the opposite. Uh, you can think of it in terms of another idiom about size, um, feast or famine. Uh, this one, right, feast, means a lot of food. So the size of the event, the feast, a lot, right? A lot of food. A famine is then little, right? Having a little bit of food. Right? That idiom has the two size components. It has a different meaning, uh, but it has the two size components just like thick and thin. So you can think of thick then as the feast. Thick means to uh, have a lot of something. Right? If I have a thick right, uh, bookshelf, right, then you might think I have a wide range of books on this shelf. Whereas thin is to not have enough. Right? You can also think of money. Money would be a good example. Imagine a lot of your paper bills of money stacked up. If your stack of money is thick, you have a lot of money. If it's thin, you have a little bit of money. Right? That's sort of the idea. That's not a perfect idea, but that's sort of the idea. So the meaning uh, through thick and thin is in good times and bad times, or steadfastly and loyally. Right? So this is usually used for a relationship between people. And you'll see that in my example. Chris and I have known each other since we were kids. We went through primary, middle, high school, and university together. I guess you could say we've been through thick and thin. Okay, So our relationship, Chris and I, we've known each other for a long time. All the way from kids to adults going through college. In that time... We know there was probably good times and there was probably bad times. So the good times, of course, are the thick times, the bad times, the thin times. We've been together that entire time, right? So that shows us how the relationship was. Give the idiom a try. I hope you're having a great day. Talk to you later. Bye-bye.